Transferring money overseas using your bank can be one of the easiest ways of doing it, but it can also be the most costly. In this video, we're going to look at three cheaper ways of transferring money overseas. Money transfer companies, peer-to-peer -peer transfer companies, and money remitters. We'll fill you in on how they work and we'll suggest when you should consider each one. After watching, you should have a better idea of the best way for you to transfer money overseas. Okay, the first option is using a money transfer company like OFX or TorFX. This is generally a much cheaper way of transferring money overseas because of their exchange rates and lower fees. Sometimes it can take a bit longer than using your bank for a couple of reasons. Setting up an account can take up to 48 hours to be completed depending on the company you use. And when you actually make a transfer, it could take a day or two longer. The extra effort is well worth it though. We would suggest using them for any time you're making a transfer of more than $1,000 because they're generally much cheaper than your bank. Peer-to-peer -peer transfer companies are very similar. The difference is they don't physically transfer the money from one country to another. They match your transfer with the one going in the opposite direction, saving the need for money to cross borders. They include companies like TransferWise or Currency Fair. The benefits are similar, their rates are generally better, and their fees are often lower. You still need to set up an account but the transfer itself can be a bit faster. These companies are a good option when you're transferring anything up to about $10,000. When it comes to making smaller transfers to family and friends, you could consider using a money remitter. They're especially good for amounts up to $1,000 and to countries like the Philippines or India. World Remit and InstaRem fall into this category and companies like this often offer cash pickup which means you can send the money to family and friends and they can pick it up within minutes. They often have maximum transfer sizes so we would suggest using them when you need to make a small money transfer overseas. But they could be your only choice if you want the person you're sending the money to to pick up physical cash. So we've provided you with some options and you know the process is different to using your bank. So how does it all work? First, you'll need to register your details, so make sure you have some identification with you. Some companies require both photo ID and proof of address. Next, you'll need to enter the bank details of the person you're transferring the money to. These details will depend on the country they live in. Finally, you'll need to pay for your transfer. Each company has different ways of doing this, including bank transfer, BPAY, or credit card. Now, obviously, this is a bit more work than simply logging into your internet banking and making the transfer, but the money you can save is well worth the effort. At the end of the day, the higher the amount you're transferring, the more important the exchange rate becomes which is why it's really worth exploring your options for anything over $1,000. We'd say any of our suggestions are good for transfers up to $10,000 and a money transfer company is usually the way to go for higher amounts, especially if it exceeds $50,000. The easiest way to find the best option is to use a comparison table like ours, which will allow you to compare the rates of large, reputable and secure money transfer companies in one place.